Hey, what's up guys? It is Lime from Variety Gaming 101 bringing you a very special video. So we're going to be doing a review slash showcase kind of video today with a site called bot.tf. It's basically an automatic trading bot which will do trades for you and post to certain places for you. I haven't actually checked it out yet, so let's get right into it, shall we? Alright guys, so before we get started here, I just wanted to say that I am not affiliated with this website. I am just doing a review showcase because I've been interested in finding something like this and I finally found this site. And I've, I'm actually interested in, very much interested in using this website because I do a lot of trading. And uh, yeah, so it costs uh, $9.99 or like $10 US dollars a month. And uh, there's so there's that or 7 TF2 keys a month. And also, uh, one thing to remember keep remind, uh, to remind you guys of is that you're, you cannot be marked on steamrep.com so if you're marked as a scammer they won't allow you to use this and your steam level on steam must be at least level 2 which is really low so it shouldn't be that hard to get so yeah I'm just gonna order this and we'll go take a look at the next part shall we alright guys so you're gonna have to bear with me here as this is a, kind of more of a first impressions video as I haven't actually used the buy yet so I just ordered it the bot will immediately add you on steam and say hi thank you for using bot.tf I'm your personal trading bot from now on head over to panel.bot.tf to customize me if you have any questions do not hesitate to contact bot.tf support so we're here we're going to the dashboard so it tells you if steam's having issues which more than often than not it is for trading it tells you the alerts uh, the bots here. Then you got your dashboard. You can add prepaid credit supply store. Not sure what that is. Credit history. So basically, what you do with your credit, I guess. There's referrals. So I read this already. If you, uh, if you, every time you refer a friend and they buy a bot, you get two dollars and fifty cents in credit, which you can use to renew your bot settings, which I haven't checked out yet. Donate. You, you get it. Then you click on your bot and customize stuff. So let's take a look at things one by one here. So first, we we'll did this last, I guess, or later on because there's a lot to this. When you click on the bot, I checked that already. So we go to settings here. We can see everything here. There's my business email, my trade offer URL. That's so you can withdraw and with deposit items. Then you go to, um, let's see, go to, what's supply store? I want to know what that is, let's see. Oh, okay. Oh yeah, that's right. They are, they, that's right. They're adding this thing that they said that you can buy and sell your things for cash on their website. So, or sell, I mean. So like if you have items in store and people can pay, buy things off you for cash, that's pretty cool. I'm not sure how that's going to work, but then your prepaid credits. So you can add prepaid credit to your, to your uh, so you can, for new stuff if you have money at the time and then of course the dashboard so this is all that's really important so we're going to check this out um, so you click on the bot there is our bot with its weird picture <laughs> and let's see its server, its version, it's when it expires, the trade offer URL mine actually had three spots in this inventory so if I go to trade offer it I can uh, go here, here's my items, there's their inventory, there was three crates in it so uh, what I can do is it, the like make sure you sign up with your main steam account obviously so like if I want to sell some stuff let's say I wanted to sell um, I got a lot of junk in here once again. So let's say I wanted to sell my strange kill street cleaners carbine and my Blitzkrieg minigun. I can click here to confirm, confirm this, confirm it on my phone really quick, which I'll do in one second. And it should add it to the bot. It's gonna confirm Steam is so slow on the phone for some reason. On on uh, well Android at least it's probably like that on iOS too because the app is just really bad. Um, so when we it should do that in a second. There's also chat command so you can type restart in the chat it'll restart the bot. Sync force the bot to reload your config. Currency if you type currency to return the stock. So if I type this and I go currency, it should say I watch. Scrap and yeah see everything's at zero because I just got the bot so there's nothing in stock right now. You can craft specific items. You can do scrap to reclaim, reclaim, refine, that that kind of thing. Uptime. They said they're going to add more because this is beta right now, but it's pretty good so far by the looks of it. It's really well done by the look of it. So, um, Next, there should be some more stuff here. One second. Uh, oh, yeah. So here, main menu, configuration. We can add general config. Let's see. The bot name should be, I'm going to do Limey Bot. Avatar URL. So I guess you can add a URL avatar, but it has to be, you can't upload it to here. You have to actually find a URL, so you can change the picture. Profile description, you can do that. I'll do that after. Allow donations. It says it's, uh, you can't do donations right now without a specific uh, thing because they don't want you stealing items from people, I guess. Uh, allow overpay. So if someone adds, you obviously want to allow overpay because if someone adds more currency, then it'll accept it and then you get more profit. <laughs> allow escrow. I usually do no because. Uh, I don't want to, I don't want people to have to wait. I don't want to wait three days for my items to be traded. Allow private profiles, yes. Automatic craft metal. You can do that. I'll save that. Then you go backpack.tf config. Enable automatic listing management. Uh, okay, that's neat. So then you can do the listing notes. It, you can do like whatever it says on all your trades. Notifications. 
So it can tell you on Steam if you get a trade or a donation or Steam status. I'll leave that off. We can save that. Currencies. Let's see this. Uh, so I guess this just shows you automatic key value. So you can use automatic key value or you can do it to set your own. So basically it tells you the value. You can set the value of your key and how much it's worth to you. Item banking. I'm not sure what this is. Let's take a look. I what is item banking? Banking an item means you're buying and selling. Oh, so basically you can buy and sell an item repeatedly and make more profit based on what your ratio is and if you're beating other people. So that's pretty cool. So it says you can buy keys for 18 refined and sell it for 18.33. That is just an example. So basically I can look. I can buy a few keys, sell two keys. You can do different, add different items to here. See? You can add different items. That's pretty cool. So I can do that automatically and just make as much profit as possible. Because obviously I want to try to make more than 10 US dollars a month so I can keep paying for this. Buy orders, you can buy certain things and it'll list it on backpack.tf as long as as well as sell orders. So you have these five items in here. So I can go uh, let's try this really quick. I have this strange clip kill street cleaners carbine. Um I'm gonna try to sell this for I guess it, it's kill streak. It's worth like seventy or sixty cents on market, so let's go like this. Sell for two point two point Yeah, we'll just do refined. I wanna see if it works, so then you can do backward to table listing notes. You can use your default listing notes by not filling it out, but I'll put, I can just do that for now. And then add listing. Let's take a look. There's this. There should be a way to actually check it out on backward.tf. So if I go like this, go to backward.tf really quick, I should be able to see it. So I go to um, classifieds. Um, this. Cleaners, combine, quality, strange, and kill streaker, standard. And then we should be able to see it. Yeah, here's mine. Twenty four seven trading bots me offered by Limey Bot. So it does work. And then I bet if I if someone I get someone to trade two ref to it, it should work just fine. So that's pretty cool. That's neat. So I'm actually the cheapest one there. So there's two, then three, then four point six six, and I'm the 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 one cheapest one there. So that's pretty cool. Then we can go to trade offers received. Oh, it just shows you the history. See, this is it shows you the history of the trade offer, so that's pretty cool. So I traded at my Kill Street Cleaners Carbine, the Strange, and the Blitz Creek Minigun. Sent offers as well. I don't know what this. Is. Oh, I don't know why I would send offers, but I, oh yeah, I guess you can make it send offers to other people if you wanted to. The logs, you can see like what's going on there. You can add backpack slots. So they all come with 800 slots, and then you can add backpack spanners, then choose to use them because the bot's always in game. I guess it's always running in game. See, and then your statistics. Oh, so as you can see how much trades you've done and I guess the profit you have and see average trades per day and average profit per day. So yeah, it's pretty cool in my opinion. Like I've been wanting something like this for quite some time. I used to use a site called Dispenser.tf. Dispenser.tf was good, but let's be honest, it's executed poorly and they kind of went downhill. So this is pretty neat. I like this a lot. So we'll have to try this out some more and maybe I'll make a future video on it. So tell me what you guys think. And if you're going to use this, I'll put a link in the description. It does cost $10 a month, but for me it was worth it because I want to use something like this. So yeah, if uh, if you enjoyed it, let me know. If you or not enjoyed it, uh, if you enjoyed the video, let me know. And if you want to check, wait, tell me what you think of this, really. So thanks for watching, guys. Have a good day. Peace.